I found a new way to create UGC ads with AI that will save you $1,200 per week and will double your conversion rate. These ads that you're seeing right now will cost you anywhere from $200 to $500 for one video. And it will also take you about one to two weeks to receive it back from the UGC creator. While these videos, you can create them within an hour and they will cost you less than $10 to create. And they are completely customizable. If you own a business and you're not leveraging this AI, then you're not only losing money each month on ads that don't work, but you're also missing out on the opportunity to double down on the type of ads that work and you can generate them quickly. That's the entire thing with this AI. It doesn't matter if you own an e-commerce brand or if you want to start making money online with AI, learning this skill will massively benefit your business. Now, one of my friends actually owns and pay that agency. And before he used this method, he was actually hiring designers because he himself has zero understanding of how to create good ads, of how to make UGC ads. He was hiring all of those people to create the ads for that. But now that he has implemented this method, his profit margin went up to like 85% because he could do all of it himself. And that was actually super simple to do. Now to create these type of ads, we're actually using three different AI tools. We're using ChatGPT and two other AI tools that no one's using yet. The combination of all of this together is super powerful. Like you've seen so far, these type of ads are doing as good as normal ads. I've discovered this method myself through Twitter where I found this video went viral and I will show you exactly how you can recreate that in this video. So first I will teach you the exact method for how you can find your products for if you want to use this for the TikTok shop, for example. Then I will give you my custom ChatGPT prompt so you can generate hyper realistic looking images that you can use in your ads. And then lastly, I will review how we can turn all of this in a good looking ad. Now let's dive in. Now the first step is to find a product that actually sells. If you already have a product, you can skip this step. But if you want to make money using the TikTok shop, then you need to go to Kalo Data. You can actually get a free trial for like seven days, I believe. Then you go over to products and then here, you can see high potential affiliate and sales growth rapidly. Now, if we go over here, we can scroll down and we can just see a combination of different products. We can see how much revenue they have generated. If anything catches your attention, just click on it and then you can analyze these products. So for me, this product caught my attention as it is pretty expensive. It has done $2 million in revenue so far. That's 75K per day. And there has been a lot of items sold. Now, what you can see is you can see all of these creators that have previously made a video about it, and then you can even watch their content. So that's pretty good. You can already see if this is a good video to use. And if you like this video, you can even download it or use it as B-roll. Just use this inspiration because if these videos already can make like 300K, 200K, 74K, then we should be able to do something similar to that. Now, the second step is we need to find an actor or a UGC creator that we can use in our video. So for this, you want to head over to Arcad. I will leave a link to this in the description down below so you can try it out for yourself. This, in my opinion, is one of the best AI UGC creator platforms out there. So I use it for my ads. Now, after you log in, then you can create a new project. And here you want to create a new actor. Now, within this, you can choose any of these actors and they're all human-like. They're actually real humans and they just record their own version. In my opinion, Helen is one of the best, but there are a few other ones that are pretty good as well. So for this specific example, I'm gonna type in Heather. So then what I need to do is I need to make screenshots of her face. So what I actually do is I just hit this and then I make four different screenshots of different moments. So it can be a face close. And all of these screenshots, I can use this inside ChatGPT. The more references you add into there, the more accurate it will be. Make sure that you actually choose an actor that matches with what your product is selling. So for example, if it is advice for guys, then you want a man for it. If it is a product that certain women will like, then a woman will work better because they can resonate more with them. So now that I have these screenshots, the next thing to do is we need to get a screenshot of this product. You can find it through the TikTok product link or you can look this product up on Amazon and then you can find it right here. So I have this product right here 
And what I can do is I can take this image, I can just save this image, and then I can use this inside ChatGPT alongside with my other images. Now, additionally, if you want to have a certain pose that you want your avatar to use, then you can look up the product on YouTube or on TikTok as well. And for example, I found this lady here and she's holding our exact product. So what I can do is I can take a screenshot of that. Then alongside that, I put it into ChatGPT. And if I then upload these images, inside ChatGPT alongside with this prompt. I will leave this prompt in the description down below so you can copy that. Then I get an image like this. So I've done this already because this takes like 45 seconds and I don't have the patience to wait. So here we have this amazing image of this lady holding our product and she's smiling right now. So I tried something else with her mouth closed because if you have a character that is smiling, when you animate them, sometimes the generation tool will try to make them talk and you don't want to have that happen. Or if you do, you can also lip sync it later. So this all depends on you. If you want to have the lips open, if you want their teeth showing or if you want their lips closed. So that depends on what you want. Now, if you're happy with your image, this might take you a few tries and it might look slightly different than your image input image but overall it does a very good job at it so then you save this image over here and then you have it downloaded in your pc and then you're ready for the next step so step number four is animating or images now what you need to do next is you need to choose an image to video generator for me i'm using kling i find that the most accurate and at the time of trying this out i was using kling 1.6 but they've just released 2.0 which is supposed to be even better so what you want to do is you want to go over to video so here you want to drop in your image and then you click on open and now you can give it a prompt to make it hold the image. Now for the prompt, I have this prompt right here. So a silent TikTok influencer. I say silent because I don't want her to talk. Uh, if you want her talking, then you can prompt that too. Um, she's showing off the product to the camera for a video. And then you want to add in a negative prompt. And in a negative prompt, you can actually tell it to do talking. So it won't be talking. Lip movement. But you can also do a bunch of other things like blurry, distorted, overexposed. And then what you can do is you can generate this. This is quite expensive within Kling, um, but if you use the 1.6, it's actually a lot cheaper and it still works the same. So this will take you, depending on how busy the servers are, like right now, five minutes, but it can take you anywhere from like one to 10 minutes. I actually generated a few of them. You can see them right here. And here you can choose your favorite one. So for example, here we have her smiling a lot more. Then we have her here holding it like this. And then you have it here holding it like this. Like I always do a couple of tries with each of my characters because it can always be better. Now that you've made your animated character that's holding the products like this, it's time to generate your script and getting it into Arcats. So I already generated my script using ChatGPT. You can just ask it to make a short script for your video. Then you go back into Arcats, then you select your character. So I'm gonna add this character right here and then you're gonna write your script. Now we can have a listen to what she's saying. So it will generate the voice right if now you feel bloated and after we can meals, have you a listen. Definitely take this. I have tried every digestive enzyme and this is the only one that completely eliminates all of my bloating and now I can eat anything I want without feeling uncomfortable afterwards. This already is quite good, but you can have complete control over the voice. For example, you can add in a bit more of style aggregation. You can lower the speed a little bit because I think she's talking a little bit too fast. And then you can try again. If you feel bloated after meals, you should definitely take this. I have tried every digestive enzyme and this is the only one that completely eliminates all of my bloating. And now I can eat anything I want without. Okay, so yeah, this is pretty good. So you can regenerate your voice over and over again until you get the perfect voice. So do this first before you generate your video. Now that we have our script ready, we have our voiceover ready, we can now send it and we can now create our video. So this usually takes a few minutes and for this video, I already have this one prepared right here. Now, if I go over it, it will play. So let's just have a look at it. If you feel bloated after meals, you should definitely take this. I have tried every digestive enzyme and this is the only one that completely eliminates all of my bloating. And now I can eat anything I want. So yeah, that already is pretty amazing. Now we have the last step and that is editing everything together. Now for this video, this usually takes me around like 30 minutes max. All you have to do is lay out the files throughout your timeline. Make sure you start with the generated video that you made within Kling. And then what you need to do is you need to remove the background from your UGC creator, add in some B-roll of the product footage that you have. And then after you've done all of that, 
you have your own completed video that looks like this. Now, this method is not limited to anything. You can use this for TikTok shop. You can use this for normal Facebook ads. You can use this for any type of video where you need to have a person talking about your product. And the great thing is you can make them hold any type of products using ChatGPT. So this wasn't possible before, but thanks to ChatGPT, you can do it now. And if you combine it with Arcad, then you can make some pretty great videos. If you want to try this out yourself, then I will leave a link to Arcad in the description down below where you can test it out for yourself, see if you like it. And with Arcad, you should be able to make at least 10 videos per month for a fraction of the price that a normal UGC creator will cost. You have full control over the outcome because you write the script yourself and you have full control over the editing because you do that yourself or you can hire someone to do it for you. Click the video that's on the screen right now if you want to see seven different AI tools that are totally worth it that you need to try out right now.